So for today, we're going to be looking at the Titans more specifically. We're going to be looking at the untethered edge set pieces, whatever I call this video, where we essentially get pieces from the untethered edge set and then make individual sets from those pieces. So we've already done the review and shader review. They're both right here. You guys can check them out. Definitely check out the review video because I go pretty hard on one of the classes. It's the Warlocks. Warlocks get it pretty hard. Um, but I also do show examples of what I think they should have done with the armor. So it's not just me bashing it for no reason. I genuinely think that, that Warlock could have got some better pieces. And then for the shader video, we go through all the shaders that I currently own. And we've already done the Hunter sets, which they're right here. You guys can check it out. Definitely check it out. I think there's some good, really good pieces for the Hunters. But Titans, I actually really like your sets a lot as well. So if you guys like the video, like, comment, subscribe. It really does help because a huge portion of the people are actually not subscribed. So if you can do me a favor, like, comment, sub. Hit the bell notification because that also does help. But other than that, let's check out some of these sets. So to start off, we're going to be using the Untethered Edge Helmet, which I think looks absolutely amazing. And for this one, we're going for... So in my head, I think we're going for like a Vex theme, which I don't know. Obviously, we're going to be using a, a shader that goes well with Vex, which was why we're using the Continuum Alloy. For the arms, Kabir's Brazen Grips is a really good uh, set for a Vex themed. For the chest piece, we're going to be using Armamentarium with the secondary en energy ornament. I think this ornament looks amazing. We're also going to be using the boots from the Untethered Edge just because these boots are super dope. And then the Phenotype Plasticity Mark. I decided to go something kind of calm for the Phenotype Plasticity. I mean, I could definitely use the helmet. I think the helmet would have been a good choice, but I wanted something calm because the arms, chest piece, boots, all those three pieces specifically have a lot of white. And I didn't want to do that. That being said, you, you probably could have used the chest piece. So, you, so that way you could have that white uh, radio larian chest piece. I think that would have been cool. And then an exotic arm for the Titans. But I don't even know if Titans have like a Vex theme piece that's good. Uh, because they do have a chest piece. Uh, specifically, the uh, Heart of Inmost Light has an ornament for it. But it looks terrible in my opinion. But yeah, I definitely like this one. I would probably just switch out some of the shaders. Because I don't like that the secondary energy has like that chrome yellow and then the boots had nothing on that so that's probably like where my biggest gripe comes in but overall i think the set looks amazing i would probably say females look way better than the males for this one just because males i don't know what it is it's probably just like they're bulky and for me this just looks way better with when it's not bulky so titans let me know what you guys think about this one as for the next set we're gonna be using the arms and i actually think these arms are way better than the hunters like by far because they're at least at least the shoulder pads are not like super small and they also have gauntlets which look really cool as well so overall better but for this one we're gonna be the whole theme of this one is just pointy which i know i, I do pointy bits a lot and specifically with this exotic the mask of the quiet one is just a good choice for that just because the ears are pointy the horns are pointy and yeah, let's get started. So for the chest piece and themic invocation plate for the boots, Technosaurus Stompers, and then for the Mark Thunderous Impact Mark. Uh, for the shadering Dreaming Spectrum, just because there's some pieces here that will counter counteract some of the other pieces, I guess you would say, uh, specifically and themic invocation, if I remember correctly. Not only that, I just wanted something to be like super bony because we're all going for like a pointy look. So I just thought pointy, bony, bony. Now it's gonna look pretty cool. And I actually think the set looks amazing. I probably would switch the helmet out for something that is a little bit more pointy or has a mouth. But I don't think Titans have any piece like that specifically that has like a mouth with pointy bits. I'm specifically thinking of like the Warlocks with their Ahamkara helmet. I think that would have been way better. But yeah, I definitely think the set looks pretty cool. Um, it's definitely not the best one. I'm going to be honest with you. But I don't think this is the worst one either. Let me go... As for the next set, we're going to be using the chest piece, and I personally think this is the worst one. I think the, the bone one that I made before looks at least coherent. This one is just like, I don't even, maybe pointy was my, my, my thing too, because the helmet's pointy, the arms are pointy, the chest piece is definitely pointy, and then the mark is not pointy, but the boots are super pointy as well. So I don't know where I was going for this one, but I don't think it looks that bad. It's definitely not the arms for the time, for the hunters. That one is the worst i'm gonna be honest that's the worst that i've made in these videos this one i think is the, like the next one honestly it's just the chest piece is not good 
um, or at least I wasn't finding any good combinations with it. That being said, I would probably just combine it with some other untethered edge pieces, and I think that would be way better. Honestly, I just really wish that the chess piece, the lines and the, the blue lines for the Omnicronia, I honestly just wish that they just went in and made that a glow. I think that would have been way better because then I could have been like, okay, it has a glow. I can combine it with phenotype plasticity because that would be really cool. And then just have a shader that has white glow. That would have been way better. Oh, excuse me. That would have been way better. Instead, we just got this really weird chest piece that has just a really terrible texture. But yeah, for the helmet, Forian helm. For the exotic, we're actually going to be using Kaiden Ramparts. For the boots, Crushing Greaves, and then for the Mark Illustrious Chromite Mark. So yeah, um, I definitely think this is the worst one. Definitely some cool pieces here. I really like the Crushing Greaves a lot. And yeah, I don't know what it is. Let me know what you guys think. It's def definitely not a terrible look. I would just switch out the chest piece, but that defeats the purpose because we're li literally here for the chest piece. So yeah, I just could not find anything cool with this. I would probably would just go back to the drawing board with this one because I don't think the chess piece is terrible. Definitely not the hunter style because the hunter, I think, is the worst chess piece. But it's just I really should have given myself more time for this one. Let me know what you guys think. And then last but not least, we're going to be using the mark. And I think the mark is super, super cool. That being said, um, there are some pieces I would switch out for this now that I've like made more of these pieces so for the helmet iron pledge ornament for the arms iron fellowship gauntlets for the chess piece we're going to be using uh i was going to say fist of the north star again dog uh curious of the falling star and then iron remembrance greaves for the boots and then for the mark obviously we're using the untethered edge mark so i really like this mark that being said i do explain or i do say this in the video as well in the review video that I do think the crotch plate should have been with the boots. I don't think they should have put it with the mark because now you have this like different geometry for the the mark and then everything else has like a different geometry, which is why like I really don't like that crotch piece uh, because honestly, the only piece I would switch out would be the Iron Fellowship Gauntlets. I would probably just put Iron Remembrance Greaves or Iron Remembrance Gauntlets in this one and I think that would have been way better. That being said, you can also use the Iron Simiki armor. That would be really cool as well. Obviously, I'm going for a Japanese look. And I, yeah, I, you know what? My Mongolian look would probably be really cool with this set as well. But yeah, let me know what you guys think about this one. I definitely like it. This one is super, super cool shader. And we're using Sato Tribe, the best shader in the game. And yeah, I definitely think switching the iron remember or the iron fellowship to the iron remembrance arms that would have been would have been a way better that being said they are bulky so you would have had a very bulky titan that being said i mean that's kind of the point of the titan so that's not bad at all um yeah i think that would have been way better uh there is no other piece where i'm like oh that would have been way better because i think iron remembrance just for the arms and boots would have been way cooler that being said you could probably switch out the iron remembrance greaves for the iron simiki armor that would have been a little bit cooler that being said i don't i don't know it's just it's hard to explain so let me know what you guys think titans let me know what you guys think about the sets that i made i definitely think there's some dope pieces in here specifically the first set i think is just absolutely amazing it's one of my favorite sets and the last set i think is really cool as well it definitely has a lot of potential to do some really cool uh styles but that third set's pretty terrible and the second set is really cool as well i definitely think again like the hunters titans you just got you just got one that was, i was like not the greatest but definitely better than the arms for the hunters for sure so let me know what you guys think i appreciate you guys coming up to this point remember to like comment subscribe it really does help a lot you like you guys have no idea how much it helps but yeah i appreciate y'all be safe i will see you guys later